Hello, my name is Sorcerer Kit, and we are in for another Culinary Crucible. This time, it's going to revolve around confectionery goods, or in other words, sugar. Now, I'm going to go over the mechanics of this event, what are, who our chefs are, and of course, the recipes. So, sit back, relax, and let's go over this together. So I can't make any assumptions. I will go over the mechanics of this event. If you know what to do, then feel free to skip. If you're new to the game, then this is just what you need. You're gonna send your boys first on excursions for ingredients. Now, two of those boys have to be the featured chefs. In this case, it's gonna be Jack and Ville. And if you don't have either one of those cards, if you're that new, don't worry. You're actually able to purchase uh, their uniforms in the shop uh, below. So if you don't know how to do that, I do have a video on that. Now you're going to get ingredients from these excursions. Now, this is not exactly my favorite part of this event because you're not really guarantee all ingredients. And you can you don't also don't choose the grade. So the grades you can get varies between bronze, silver, and gold. And the more time you spend on these excursions, the more of a chance you'll have getting higher quality ingredients. Now, uh, you're going to use those ingredients to make dishes, and then you're going to serve them to the judges. The judges are random, and they vary from, uh, what was it, lenient, fair, and uh, critical. And the judges give you a score from 1 to 10, each judge, and that score uh, translates to tokens that you can earn. So for example, uh, the minimum uh, score you can get is 3, because each judge would give you a 1, and the maximum score you can get is a 30, because each judge would give you a 10. Now let's introduce our chefs. Jack and Ville will be the stars of our event, and there are two ways to get them. Uh, you can either take your chance on the banner and try and get both of them, or if you want to conserve gems for the upcoming Halloween event that I know is going to come up next month, because why would it not? Uh, you can save up enough chef tokens to get the chef SSR key. From there, you get to choose either Jack or Vil. Now, there's really nothing too special about these cards. Uh, Jack is going to be a double flora card, while Vil is going to be a cosmic flora uh, type card. So just go with whoever you like the best. For me personally, it's going to be Jack. I mean, Ville is cool and all, but I would prefer Jack. I don't know why. I think just think Jack is cool between the both of them. So with that, let's go ahead and dive right into our next section. So let's go ahead and dive right into those recipes. For the chocolate cake, we're going to need sugar, cacao beans, flour, and eggs. Then for the macarons, you're going to need sugar, almonds and eggs and then for the fruit terrine you're going to need sugar fruit that's generically fruit apparently and gelatin so next we have liore leo i'm not sure how to pronounce that but let's go ahead and continue you're going to need sugar rice and dairy i'm going to assume that's milk so let's just say milk next we have Soup powder? Listen, the translation wasn't that great on the website, but so we'll, we'll just go with that and see, see what the game says. But for this pretty soup picture, we have sugar, rice, and beans. And then we have that very classic apple pie for sugar, fruit, and a pie crust. So that, that's actually pretty self-explanatory, but you know what to do. So next we have the meringue cake. It looks very pretty, by the way. And you're gonna need sugar, fruit, and eggs, followed by the very delicious almond pudding. That's gonna require sugar, almond, eggs, and milk. And then finally, we have the avocado chocolate mousse, which is an interesting combination, to be honest. I don't think I've ever had chocolate and almond before. Makes me kind of want to go to the grocery store, get avocados, and just dip it in chocolate. So, where was I? Oh, right. The sugar 
It's going to require sugar, avocados, cacao beans, gelatin, and dairy. And that concludes the recipe overview for this event. I hope you all have a very successful time getting through this. And I really do hope you get as many gems as you can because next month is going to probably drain everyone's gem reserves. So happy cooking and I will see you all soon.